What's up guys? Today we are going to get some ovals out of wheels using a drill, bushing, and kingpin setup. Uh, I got these old mini zombie hogs that I ovaled because I'm not very good at skating. So we are going to try to get it out and I'll let you guys know what we do and how we do it. So yeah, we're right now in Alex's workshop and let's see how this goes. And I have a good feeling I've done it before so I'm pretty sure it'll come out. But yeah, let's see how it goes. Hey guys, so like John was saying, we are going to be lathing. Uh, pretty much lathing is the process of spinning something real fast. Um, and you're just shaving it off to take a layer off, get it nice and even. Um, things you're going to need. Um, we do it with a drill. I like a quarter drill because it's a little easier. You plug it in. Don't have to worry about batteries dying. Um, personal protection. If you guys want to, you can go as crazy as you want. You could go with a respirator. Um, there is going to be thane dust coming off of here. You can, you know, we advise you to use it if you don't want to. That's all you. Safety glasses, same thing. Uh, other than that, like John was saying, we use a kingpin. Um, it doesn't really matter as long as it's big enough. I, I normally use like a two and a half inch uh, kingpin. And we're going to be using two bushings, right, like that. Just a cone and a barrel, that's all you need. And proper way to set it up, we normally will throw a bushing on the kingpin, grab your wheel, try and center it pretty good. You're gonna grab that cone, put that cone bushing facing straight in, push that all the way down, get your nut, tighten your nut all the way on, and you're gonna really, really wanna snug this down because the whole thing is these bushings are preventing this wheel from spinning on the bolt. Um, so you can, you know, get a couple wrenches, crank it down. And then what you're going to do is chuck that little bit up in your drill. And we like to use a vise like this here. We'll get the vise, we'll rotate it around however we need to. We'll clamp the handle of the drill without crushing it because remember it is plastic. We'll cramp that or that will uh, clamp that up right in here. And either John will hold the trigger down uh, when I'm ready to start lathing. If you are doing it solo, you can get a zip tie, kind of zip tie it when you're ready. Get all your tools, make sure everything's set. Um, and then pretty much other than that, we use files to, you know, to uh, shave it off. I'll typically use a file like this. I like this file because it has actually two different uh, um, like a, uh, it's different, you know, grit, I guess you could say. This one's very coarse. It'll take off a lot of material really fast. And then this one, it's a lot finer. And uh, you can kind of hone in your wheel once you're done taking off the bulk of the material. Um, uh, also, I like using the flat side. This side is a little curved. So don't do that because then you might put a curve in your wheel. That wouldn't be good. So other than that, we're going to get to it and we'll show you the process of how it's done.
here? Yeah. You want me to smooth it out? Smooth it out. Just no. so it's not this. It's Tom Ground, homie. Spin it really quick. Just slow. Yeah, I think it's fine. I think it's just not centered yeah. as much on the bowl. All right, so we uh, got it off of it now, and we're pretty sure the oval came out. So, yeah, I'll let you guys know when I ride them again if it worked. We're going to do the rest of them, and then I got another set of mini zombie hogs in the 78A that we're going to try to also get the oval out. So Another good thing, it also resurfaces your wheels and makes them really clean again, um, and it will give them a new fresh stone ground look and feel yeah so hope you guys liked the video don't forget to like and subscribe leave a comment if you have any questions on it and I will see you guys next time hope you guys like the bonus video and we might be doing more bonus videos here and there on Fridays but we'll keep you up to date on that too take it easy let's get to 1k guys we got it